Hey guys, it's your girl Pixie and I'm back with another video. If you guys are new to my channel, welcome to Pixie's World. If you guys are not new, welcome back. Um, today's video is basically going to be about either let their eggs go or be with them. Um, but before we get into the video today, guys, please like, please comment, please share, please subscribe, and please be sure to follow me on all my social medias. Alright guys, I don't know if y'all can hear me. I hope y'all can hear me, but um, today's video was about exes. Y'all, y'all need to either get back with your exes or y'all need to let them go. Like, it's so I got some I got some notes here, y'all. Please. Hmm. Alright, so y'all, I'm in nifty fifties. So if y'all see me talking to somebody, I'm just I'm in. 50 50 so i started going around the different places where i could just chill and get a distraction from my normal surroundings so i'm in nifty 50 the other day i was in starbucks we, we just hopping around um but all right guys um so let me say this start pursuing and trying to start a new situation if you're not done with your ex it's so confusing um hashtag please stop the madness stop the madness guys um, get over your ex girlfriend, ex boyfriend first. It's toxic. It's, it's toxic. It's toxic and it's unfair and it's just too much. Um, Y'all will be quick to be like, oh, you know, I'm not, I'm not going through this in my next relationship. I'm not going through this. And when y'all meet people, y'all be so quick to be distanced and nonchalant. But then y'all go pick up that phone for the ex girlfriend, do anything for the ex girlfriend. When y'all know it didn't work. Like, y'all will hang over the new person here, which your ex-girlfriend did. But then be mean to the new person. But then just go for all your ex's bullshit. Like, shit is crazy. Um, you bring unresolved hurt and energy from your past traumas with your ex. And, um, yeah, you think everybody gonna be like them. You think, oh, you know, you got your guard up thinking everybody. Or just like... You already have a negative energy going going there. You don't know this person. It's like, as soon as one thing happens, see, see, that's why, that's why, da, 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 da. And it's like, bro, you already got that energy from your ex because at the end of the day, when you're getting to know somebody, you're not going to understand them fully. So y'all going to have disagreements. Y'all going to have not many disagreements, but more so misunderstandings. And y'all be so quick to just be, like, your trauma be like, oh, see, see, I knew you was going to be like this. Or you just get impatient. Because instead of just dealing with, um, instead of just getting that know that person, or just be like, oh, because I went through this with my ex, it's like, get to know this person before you, you know what I mean? Or like, people are like, oh, I dated older people before, or oh, I dated people who did this, or I did, like, what does that mean? Like, you dated that older person, you dated that person that was a celebrity, you dated that person who was into basketball, like, we not all the same, like, you know what I mean? Um, the next thing I'm going to say is y'all don't realize that you're putting negative in the atmosphere, not being over them. Like, you still, you like this person, but you're not going to give yourself fully because you're still not over your ex. You still have this deep down hope that inside that maybe your ex and you will get back together. Or like, if you don't, why are you still messing with them? Y'all still be messing with your exes. Like, y'all still be going back to them whenever it's a misunderstanding or y'all getting annoyed by the person y'all talking to or... Y'all don't hear from them for a while. And then y'all hit your ex up or vice versa. Y'all act like y'all like somebody until your ex hit y'all up. And then y'all be distanced from the new person that's like, you don't give them a fair shot. And it's just like, it's already just demonic vibes and just bad vibes. Like, And it's like, if they so special, why didn't it work? Like, why are y'all broken up? Why not just be together? Like, why? You know what I mean? Like, y'all, it ain't work, it ain't work, it ain't work. And then, you, but y'all still be messing with your exes. Like, y'all still be dealing with them. Or it'll be like, oh, I'm, I will never get back with my ex. And it's like, you not getting back with them. But y'all still be messing with your exes. Like, it just, I just think it's just so crazy for y'all to just still be trying to, it's, it just, I just don't like the exes problem. Um, the next thing I'm saying is like, why not be with them? Just, why are you still holding on to something that's not there? Like, if y'all been messing with each other on and off and it's just sex, like, y'all y'all not getting back together. Y'all not going to be together. And it's like, when y'all dealing with y'all, y'all be hurt. So y'all be like, oh, I don't want a relationship. But it's like, 
everybody wants somebody everybody wants love like even single people like you ever notice that single people be the ones that be like oh i want i'm single i want to deal with nobody but then you're always laid up with somebody you're always got somebody over you're always got company it's like that's single but it's not single like you really have a relationship it's an open relationship but it's like single is to be by yourself getting to know yourself growing healing if you're always still entertaining somebody, always still messing with somebody, like, is that really single? Like, when you really still have to think about it, it's like, people say they want to be single, but y'all never really be single. You'll never really be by yourself. Like, you know what I mean? Like, and it just, just say you don't want no commitment, but people be still talking to people and still, I, I just, I can't even explain it. It's just like, is this, is this people convenience? This is like, you just really learn, learn how selfish people is, especially when somebody's dealing with their ex. I think it's very selfish for you to be still trying to talk to somebody and you're not done with your ex. Like, it's selfish as shit. But um, it just comes with a lot of drama. Like, you don't know if the ex over you. Then you talking to the person you chilling and the ex hit them up. And it's always the ex that hit them up. They're, and pay attention. Like, if somebody is talking and they're always talking about their ex or always bringing their exes up or... Whatever conversation, you know, when you're getting to know somebody, you're going to talk about past situations, you're going to talk about exes, but, like, pay attention to the people who always find some type of way to bring up their exes, like, they're always just friends, we just cool, depending on the situation and depending, like, you can't always say that just because somebody's still cool with their ex, they still involved with them, but I feel like you'll know, like, I feel like you'll know, like, you'll know, like, you just, you just know, you know what I mean, but, um, if you're dealing with somebody that got an ex, run very fast, run away. Like, me personally, once I hear your ex, are we still da 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 da? Um, cool. You'll be so surprised once you really get to know on somebody. And sometimes people don't tell you right away if they're still dealing with their ex. But just listen to them talk or just ask them a few questions and stuff like that. Listen to people, let them, just let them talk and you will find out. But. You will find out when it comes to exes. You can, it's like it's like your personality. You can't hide that for so long. You can't keep secrets for, for so long. So I'm just telling y'all, like if you're the one that's dealing with somebody that's still messing with their ex, leave them alone. And if you're the one that's still dealing with the ex, do the person a favor and just leave them alone. It's not fair and it's not right. Um, it's just corny. I don't think I really have nothing to say. I think y'all know how toxic it is to still deal with an ex, so I don't think I had to get, you know, deep into that. But guys, if you're not going to leave your ex alone, either be with them and leave other people alone or what, like, just don't even let the ex go or be with them. Like, just area, even let the ex go or just be with them. Stop dragging other people into your mess because you're lonely or your ex acting up this week. <laughs> but all right y'all i'm gonna keep it at that um i'm gonna make this video short and sweet you already know what i'm gonna say please pray to god please protect your peace and i'll see y'all in the next video